Welcome to Retro Crisis. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install Duimon's Mega Bezel graphics and presets. I'm going to leave two links in the description below. So firstly, open up the GitHub link. Once you open that link, you'll end up on this page. And to download the latest version of the pack, go to this green button here and then go to download zip. It's a very large file, so it might take some time to download. Once the zip file has downloaded, you need to extract that zip file to its own folder. Next, you need to go to your RetroArch installation folder and then go to the shaders folder. And then you need to create a folder called mega underscore bezel underscore packs. And then within this folder, you need to copy the Duimon download that you extracted a few moments ago. And then within the folder, you'll see a similar file structure to this. Before we continue, you just need to make sure that you've got Mega Bezel configured. If you want to learn how to do that, please check out my previous video on the topic. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. Excellent, now all you need to do is open up a game in RetroArch. Once you've opened the game, press F1 to go to the quick menu. And then go all the way down to shaders, Make sure shaders is on, go to load, go to mega bezel packs, Duimon mega bezel main, and presets. And then you've got the option of advanced, light, and standard. I'm going to choose advanced. And here you'll see a number of different systems available to you, which equate to the type of graphic you'll see on screen. So currently I've got an NES game loaded, so I'm going to find NES and then open the folder. And here you'll have a multitude of shader presets you can choose from. For this demo, I'm just going to choose the second one down, which is NES ADB Guest Bezel, and wait for it to load. And then once it does load, press F1 to go back to your game. And now you can see a pretty cool NES style border around the screen. And as usual with Mega Bezel, you get a wonderful CRT shader applied and the real time reflections on the bezel. Here's a quick demo of some of the other bezels available in this pack. I hope you found this video useful. Let me know which one of these presets is your favorite.